Today we're going to get an update on the eCoral EK Dose, and we're also going to give one away, so make sure you guys stay tuned to the end. Hey guys, Devin with Reef Dudes. Happy December, first video of December, and in holiday spirit, we're doing some awesome giveaways this month, so if you guys aren't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and that bell because you're not gonna miss a lot of these really cool prizes. So today I wanna to do a follow up on the EK dose. So I've been using this doser on the nano tank for a couple months now. So I've had a really good experience with it. Overall, I've been very happy with the doser. My favorite feature is it is literally silent. Um, so there's three different dosing modes. You can have like low, medium, high speed. I run on mine on low speed. And if I'm silent beside it, I almost can't even tell Zon unless I'm looking at it and seeing the droplets come out. So absolutely love that. Some of my other doses I have are a little on the loud side, so that was a huge plus. Now I did previously have it on the beta testing app, and now I'm actually gonna move it over to the main app. So I figured it'd be a good excuse to kind of show you guys the quick setup again and how we move that over. This one we have to move the tank for. So I mounted mine to the back of the tank. Another pro tip, if you guys have a small enough tank, or even a big tank, always put those little carpet felt things on the bottom, because it will allow you to actually move your tank to get to the back. Now I mounted the doser on the back just because it's a great way to save space. Okay, so let's hit check pairing. Uh, my phone automatically defaulted back to the regular Wi-Fi. So now when I open up the tank, you're going to see Red Sea Nano and doser. So Red Sea Nano is the EK core, which is the main eCoral controller on the tank. So now if I go into doser and got a firmware update, so might as well hit update. Downloading, upgrading, super quick. Hmm, there you go, pretty quick update. Okay, now if we look at the pump, we have pumps one, two, and three, I believe one, two, three. Yep, so one, two, and three are hooked up. I'm gonna have to double check, but I believe it's calcium is my first one. Got a C on it. Okay, so pump one is calcium. So we're just gonna add the name in. Okay, so I got my graduated cylinder and we're gonna start our pairing process. So hit next, uh, flow rate low, just cause I like it nice and quiet. Hit start. Now it's gonna run it for 10 seconds and ask us how much it is dosed into the container. If you look at the meniscus, the meniscus is kind of like the little like cup in the bottom of the water drop. The water will actually suck up the size of the glass. So you want to read just at the bottom of the meniscus. And this one's just under the line, so I'm going to say it's about 4.9 mils. Click at the very bottom, click on scheduler. Uh, pump one, so we got to get that selected for calcium, hit the plus sign. Um, from when to when, so basically 24 hours a day. Repeat every single day. Now for dosing, I'm going to tell it to dose 0.2 mils. Let's say 15 times per day, so that's three mils. So every day we get three mils broken up 15 times. So every hour and a bit, you're just gonna do a dose. Now will hit save, and that one's programmed. Now you'd obviously repeat that process for the rest of the dosing heads. Now one thing I don't want to point out because it's not quite as intuitive, is when you look at the actual scheduling for a pump. So at the bottom of the screen, we click on scheduler. And if you look, there, you can have at the very bottom, it says a maximum of three schedules per pump. Now in each schedule, you can have up to 24 doses. So what that means, if I say one mil times 24 times, it's gonna dose one mil every hour, it's 24 times a day. Now if you had a second schedule, you can break it up so doses every half an hour. And if you have a third schedule, you can break it up to a maximum of 72 doses so that you'd have a dosing every 20 minutes. So you can break it up quite a bit. Now it's not quite as intuitive because you have to have multiple schedules for that, but it's still nice to have the option to be able to do more than 24 doses. So 72 is the max per day per pump head. So I just want to throw the one out there. It's the only one type of thing that I figured might throw somebody off. Aside from that, it's pretty darn intuitive. And like I said before, on the nano tank, I've only used the low flow mode. and It's been super quiet, which is one of the reasons I love this thing. Now here comes the fun part. Um, now I'm very happy with my doser and I want to give away one to you guys. So I teamed up with the eCoral to do a bit of a Christmas giveaway. Um, there's going to be a link in the description that you guys can check out. And through there, you can enter to win yourself an EK doser. Now we're gonna let it run for about two weeks. So in about two and a half weeks from now, we're gonna do the draw. And in this time frame, if you're impatient and you wanna get one anyways, there's also gonna be a discount code in the description for 10% off, and that's gonna run for two weeks. So a little bit of extra fun for Christmas time. Hope you guys enjoy it. There's gonna be some more awesome kind of prizes and giveaways coming the next few weeks. So if you guys aren't subscribed, hit that subscribe button and that bell. 
you enjoyed this, smash that like button, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.